Holy fuck, what are you? Well, as soon as I see the monster, I'm no longer afraid. Anyway. 30 seconds. Here's a good yeah, I'm about to get out of here. <laughs> oh! Hey folks, welcome to another part of Subnautica. The last episode, we found a couple of pods and uh, they didn't really do much for us. They gave us some story, but we can't really act on that just yet. But they did give us one blueprint, so I guess that would be a good idea. We can start by crafting that one. Is it a compass? Here it is. Copper wire and a wiring kit. Copper wire I can do. Yeah, wiring kit. What's that? Is that silver? Jesus Christ, two of them. Okay. Emergency. A quantum detonation has occurred. Oh, what? Aurora's drive core. The reactor will reach a supercritical state. Something's happening. Minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Oh. Hey. Well, that's juicy. It's getting juicy now. That's great. For your convenience, the radiation suit has been added to your blueprint database. Huh. Two lead and two fiber mesh. Okay, so... Radiation suit. Does that mean we can go to the ship? Guess what we're doing today? Do I have lead? I have no lead. I have no silver. I have a copper. Okay, I have an idea of where I might be able to find some more. Let's go back to where Ozzy was. I think that's where I found my first silver. I don't know, it's been almost a week. Hey! Hey, it's more of these. Come come to me. Come to Papa. Just me and my fish buddy. Just me and my fish buddy. Abducting all your brothers. That's how it goes. It's so dark. Oh my god. It's so beautiful. Wow, look at this. Look at oh, oh, bad noises. You have anything for me? Laser cutter. Oh yes, I would like to cut things. Where the fuck is my scanner? Oh yes, beautiful. Oh wow. No, stop jumping out, I swear to god. <sighs> oh, will you look at that fish buddy? Might be easier to get in now now that it's got holes blown all over it. Always look on the bright side of things, that's what I see. I've literally only said it once though. Why is that creepy music down here? It's not... I don't like those sounds. Holy fuck, what are you? Well, as soon as I see the monster, I'm no longer afraid. Anyway. 30 seconds. Here's a yeah, I'm about to get out of here. <laughs> oh! Oh my fucking god! Oh, we got it, Stalker. Oh no. Oh! Laser cutter fragment? Oh. It's noise. Laser cutter fragment. Yep, yeah, that's it. We got. Just let me fucking. Oh! Bitch. <laughs> yes. Yeah. That's right. Run, 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 run away, motherfucker. Uh, ah. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Oh, what deep? Oh. Ah, uh, uh, leave me the fuck alone. Fish buddy, no. Oh my god, you can just corkscrew around them. Okay, I'm not gonna scan you anymore. I'll scan this instead. Ooh, Seamoth Fragment. How many do we need to make a full Seamoth? Just be the last one. Ah, oh, one more. You know, YouTube really gives you a new perspective that you've never seen before. Like, if you never record yourself, you never know how much you swear. All right, here's my New Year's resolution. Even though the New Year's is, it's not New Year's yet. Cut out swearing or reduce it. I don't, I don't need to cut it out, I'm just... I want to reduce this. That silver inventory full. Yes, I need. Holy shit! 
Holy shit! Thirty seconds. Can I scan you guys to completion? What the fuck are you? Sand sharks. Holy shit, I'm about to drown. Oh my god, I'm dying. No! Hallelujah! Almost lost everything. Whoa! Whoa! It's a big boy. Reef back. Yeah. Whoa! Ho, 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 ho. Reef back Leviathan. Oh, that's a that's a really cool name. What's this down here? Is this metal salvage? Is it a seamoth fragment? Please, 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 please. <gasps> I think we got a sea moth. Yes, no, 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 fish brother, you know you. There we go. One person sea and space vehicle. Interesting. Space? Titanium ingot. What's the... These don't look anything like the ingots I know. 10 titanium. Go. Oh. We got seven, four, get... We can do that. Oh, I really need to drink and eat. Might as well do it now. That's mean. <laughs> I keep doing that. Come on. I ain't gonna miss you with skin again. But come here. Oh my holy shit. Sorry, fish buddies. Time to go. It's okay, fish buddy. I know I killed all your siblings, but. You're fine, you're good to me. I love you. I love you, fish buddy. Aha! Uh -huh. Compass, okay, how's it work? Displace compass heading on the HUD. Oh, look! Look up top, right there! Look, I can see my direction now. Whoa! Where do I need to? Oh, I need a mobile vehicle bay. Oh, no! I need to make that first, okay. Release vehicle bay. Oh! Ooh! I stand on it and... What are those little bots? I can see, it's so dark. Huh! We got cute little drones. Okay, let's... Vehicles. We're gonna have to get that stuff again. This is Avery Quinn of Trading Ship Sunbeam. Aurora, do you read? Over. Nothing but vacuum. These all terrorist ships. They run low on engine grease, they send an SOS, you offer to help, they don't pick up. Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. It's gonna take more than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Over. I'll try them again tomorrow. Damn charter's gonna have us blowing our credits running errands for Altera. See what the long range scans pick up in the meantime. Some freaking people, I swear to god. Well, they're not coming, so. Let's have some fun here in the meantime. Hey! 11% power. Oh, I need another battery. Do I have enough copper? I have one. Yeah, I'm gonna need to put another battery in this. Ah, oh, I can only make one? There we go! Ah yes, lead line suit, providing insulation from radiation. Can I take it off? I can, and then I just have nothing. I still have a suit on. One lead, okay, two glass, please tell me. I'm missing one quartz, just one. That's life, isn't it? Five percent power! It's probably gonna be something that will blow up in my face in one, yeah! Yeah, I see. Yeah, I got my quartz, I got my quartz. Got mine, fuck you, Sister Boomer. Hello, little bots. Moment of truth. The sea moth is a fast, safe mode of transport, but remember that swimming is good for your glutes and endorphin levels. Yep, yep, I remember. I'm, I'm totally gonna keep swimming right here. Whoa! 
Get me out of here. Whoa! Look at this! Oh my god, it's a little glass ball of wonder. Let's go, little Lieutenant! Welcome aboard, Captain. Whoa! Oh, it's got a torchlight. Whoa, I can go anywhere! Oh! I did a... Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Let's go! Whoa! It makes little putt-putt noises. I love it. Come on, Peeper. I want you. There we go. Oh, another radio signal. Okay, exchange power source. Hey, 100% power. And we got a dead battery. Oh, they're reusable. Oh, another light pod. This is Officer Keen in light pod 19. The captain is gone. I have assumed command. The last thing the captain did was give me coordinates for dry land. We regroup one and a half kilometers southwest of the crash site. Stay together and good luck. This message will now repeat. Rendezvous coordinates corrupted. Transmission origin coordinates down Signal location uploaded. Well, that's convenient. We don't know where the rendezvousing thing is there. Is rendezvousing a word? Is that the correct way to see it? Meeting up. Second Officer Keen. Where? So hard to see the blue and everything up here. Okay, you know what? Let's do it. Let's test out. Oh yes, where is it? It's, it's over a kilometer away, wow. Oh, look at that speed, look at how fast we close the distance. Screw sea lights, man. Oh, ow! Something hit me! Ow! Okay, so you hit things in this and you get damaged. Oh, it's a wreck. Maybe we should have a look. Hey, we can repair the sea moth that way. That's easy. Hello, what you got for us? Come on, this is weak. This is starter stuff. Oh, really? Man, if we found this wreck at the start, we'd be doing great. Yeah, holy shit. Instant sea glide graph trap on this place. Yeah, we're gonna look elsewhere now. Yeah, it's keen. Yeah, really deep. 300 whole meters. It's a lot of meters. King Knight. Oh my god, yeah. Brilliant. We set out at night. Just when we're not able to see anything. Hello to you too. Oh, these floodlights are pretty decent actually. Yeah, I'm gonna leave them on so you guys can see stuff. Normally I save battery, but the things I do for you guys. I see some outcrops, I kinda wanna get out because copper or other things. Yeah, I gotta see my old shadow. Oh, what a freaking waste of time. I can see my old shadow, that's pretty cool. You can't see shit. Man, it's... Oh wow, we're nearly 200 meters deep now. Warning, maximum depth reached. Pile damage. Oh, ow. Oh, we can't go below, below 200 meters in this. No. That's fucked, but hey, there's stuff to look at here. Passing 100 meters. Okay. Oxygen efficiency decreased. We don't have oxygen deficiency, but... Passing 200 meters. Oxygen oh, we get nothing down here. Wow. Hold on, let's see. You got any stuff for us? Oh, we need to cut it open to access it. Great. Hey, it's okay. We have to see if you're like... Let's just see if it's anything we scan. Moon pool fragment. That's a cool name. Maybe 
We will check that out. You guys got anything? Cargo. Miscellaneous crap. Bioreactive fragment, okay. No fish buddy. Oh my god, we better go. Oxygen is the last very long down here. Okay, where were we? We were somewhere here. You know what? Oh. Open data box. Vehicle upgrade console. Thermal plant fragment. Wow, there's so much stuff to build in this game. Oh, there's an entrance. Oh, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I want to, I want to go in there. Let's not go too deep though. Welcome aboard, Captain. Just get you in place. Get closer. I want to be as close as possible in case I die from this. Okay. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen Keep efficiency right. greatly decreased. The heck is in here? Open supply crate. Oh, the day's water ration ahead of time. Oh, come on. We can't get in. Sealed. And eventual death. Oh, modification station. Okay, nothing else. Okay, bye. Jeez. Better bring my laser cutter tool next time. It's bio reactor fragment. Another one. Okay, we can go back up. There we go. Oh, yes. Oh, we got the whole blueprint. What is it? Modification station, Seamoth depth module. Ah, bond suit. I have no idea this. Oh, here's Mark 1. Titanium and glass. Yeah, we should do that. Oh, wow, so many upgrades. Storage modules, lithium, perimeter defense system, solar charger. Biodiversity in this region is unusually low. Cause unknown. There's nothing here. Cool. That's comforting. Polyaniline and computer chips, wow. Okay, we've got a whole upgrade system and stuff. We should build a base, thermal, thermal pump. Oh, another radio thing. Pretty sweet haul. I think we're almost done here. Okay, life pod. Daytime here. I buddy, it was so deep. No wonder people get the lassophobia from this game. This Ooh, you fell deep, didn't you? I don't have thalassophobia, I swear, I don't have thalassophobia! Oh my god. Oh, get up! Poor baby. So it's daytime now, turns out this place is actually green. Totally not creepy at all, yeah, look at... Look at this fella, just floating here. In the emptiness of space. You know what I'm going to call you? I'm going to call you the Lovecraft, because that's what this game is reminding me of right now. This infected water, H2O plus 30. 12 ounces, microorganism free. Huh. Wait, but this is 6 ounces and gives me plus 20. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go faster. This is totally not creepy at all. What's this? Open time capsule. I don't know what just happened. Data box. And I got... I didn't see what blueprint I got. Holy shit! Okay, that's how we remove it. Okay, let's try this again. Yeah, okay, I don't know what those are. Those are cool. PDA, here we go. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Have a quick look. What are these? Eye stalks. Interesting. Oh, they're gonna eat me even also. What's this blue thing? Huh. Oh, another banner PDA. Okay, time to go. What I get? Signal or rendezvous drive? Interesting. I got the rendezvous coordinates. To all crew. If you are reading this, then you have followed the automatic distress signal broadcast by this life pod's onboard computer. Contrary to my orders, I have been forced to evacuate. 
Your orders are to disregard my safety and attempt to reach the designated rendezvous coordinates at the nearest landmass. What? Landmass? Landmass, yeah, like, this, like I'm Catholic. I hope to see you there. Okay, so there's land in this game. I've been lied to, I thought this was a water game. Wow, voice like this girl. This is Aurora, come in. This is Keen. Light pod detached to Cape Planet, fall in 30 seconds. The computer has identified a landmass at the attached coordinates. I want you to regroup the crew there. Understood, but they are your responsibility now. Don't let them down. Captain, you need to evacuate. Negative. You'll need the ship in one piece if you're going to contact HQ on the long range. I'm attempting a controlled descent. Well, so now we know what happened. The captain died with the ship. Whoa. Rendezvous point, dry land, right here. What? What's this? What are those? Ancient floater. Why do I scan them if I never read the things about them? These vast floaters have matured in an ingenious symbiosis with the land they have attached to them. The attached landmass is raised in the water, and as older plants on the planet decay, organic residues and nutrients seep into the rock and are consumed by the floater. These circumstances must have been held for thousands of years for a floater to reach these cells. Oh. Ow. Okay. Whoa! Aha! Okay. Woo! Wow. Look at this, you never seen anything like it. Of course you have. Go outside, don't you? Huh? I don't. Hey, it's the rendezvous coordinates. Let's, where's everyone? Thought there's gonna be a landing party. Huh? No one here except this PDA. Okay. Data. Well, we have to board the Aurora, repair the long range comms, make contact with the other survivors. We can't be the only two that made it. Those are not the orders the captain gave me, and they are not the orders I'm giving you. This isn't chain of command, it's survival. My obligations as acting commander don't turn on their convenience. Get out of the water. If I get into trouble, I'll send you my coordinates. I can't let you go alone. Then come with me. You don't leave me much choice. Received emergency transmission from second officer Keen two hours after last activity. Rendezvous was a failure. Intercepted a transmission from Altera HQ. Seems they sent a data package to the Aurora. We were intercepted by a Leviathan class predator before we could reach the ship. Consider the CTO and I lost at sea. Be safe. Aww. Keen, out. No. How did you send this? Like. How do you just give up and die after set, you manage to send out a message like this? Come on, man. Right, so that was a bust. Well, I'm not gonna give up. Are you? Damn straight you're not, that's right. We're in this together. You and me, fish buddy. Well, you thought I was talking to you, no, I was talking to fish buddy. I don't know you. <laughs> I'm kidding, thanks for being here. I appreciate it. Huh? I really do. I have no idea how many views my first video has right now. I can't tell. I, I, it hasn't gone live yet. I'm recording this beforehand because I'm a brave soul. And if you're a brave soul too, if you're thinking of starting your own channel or you have, then good luck to you and thank you for being here as well. And if you haven't, well, if you've never made a YouTube channel before, then... Well, no better time than now. It's only going to get worse from here on out, right? Wow. There's cool stuff everywhere. What are you, Ming plants? That's Chinese as fuck. I'm gonna take it. I'm half Chinese, by the way, if you didn't know. Not that it matters. Jaffa cut. That does not sound Chinese. Yeah, actually, have we introduced each other yet? I don't know if I've introduced myself to you. Hi, my name is Emildra. I don't know what I expected to come with that. What's your name? I can't hear you, I've got headphones on. Hey, there's stuff up there! See that? Let's go! 
So we're near the back of the ship. Interesting. Oh, well, there's more stuff over there. Mildly suspicious. Wow, this is old. What are you? Can I scan you? Spotlight, huh? Bulkhead. Observatory. Wow, we just scan these ones and we get the blueprints. That's brilliant. Oh, yes, this is going to be brilliant for our base. Yes, that's right, our base. We're moving in together. Supply crate. Oh, I see you hiding there, Sneaky. Hang on. Ah, oh, I just put it. Oh, that doesn't hurt. Bart Toggle's log, number three. Lantern fruit. Oh, those are big. They're edible. Let's listen to Bart Toggle, even though it's number three. The Gassi survivors. This is the first time I've seen sunlight in months. After all that time in the deep, I'd been dreaming of it. Now that I'm back here, I'm finding it hard to enjoy alone. Father was right. We should never have left this place. We shouldn't have gone so deep. They do not want us down there. They? Despite my best efforts, ill health is taking hold of me. The visions are getting worse. Marguerite and father are now part of the ecosystem of this incredible planet. It's reassuring to know that when I go, I'll join them. Oh. Until then, well, there's always... Always the view. They all did. Everyone who comes here is dead. Oh, it's so sad. This game gets depressing, alright? Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. Those trees look pretty. I want some of that. Come on, fish buddy. Let's see what's up here. Hey, there's stuff down there. Okay, we gotta go down there as well. Marble melon, Chinese potato. Well, sounds like food. We can grow food in this game. Ay, 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 soy amigo. Oh, someone's observatory. Oh, there's a desk. No idea why you need one in this game, but... Voice log number one. Okay, let's find out what happened to them. This island is a godsend. Look out of the window. Oh, what's that? The dead. No predators. Fresh food. No building materials. Nothing left of the ship. Sister? And your kid says mm -hmm. we're gonna starve without more grow your beds. Kid. Speak up, kid. Oh, so help them. It's true, father. The natural growth rates are too slow to keep supporting us. All I'm saying is oceans got us surrounded. No use hiding. Sooner or later, we'll get our feet wet. The rest of your life may have been a fight made up. But I've made my decision. You want to forfeit your emergency pay to take a swim? Go ahead. Believe me, I'm thinking. Well, that turned out well, Marguerite, didn't it? Oh, yes, more stuff to eat. Oh my fucking god. Who are you? Die! Huh? I like how I'm scared of the scary noises, but then the moment I see them, I'm like, die! Hey. Purple tablet. Huh. Yeah, sniff it. Smells suspiciously like purple tablet. Ancient alien tablet with a purple symbol. Alien. Well, I guess technically everything in this game we've encountered so far is alien, so like. You know. Supply crate. Hey, it's a battery. Logs. Logs everywhere. Oh, voice log number two. Storm. Paul, Paul, to Paul Toggle's log. There we go. Data box. Sweet. Oh, Ultra Glide fins. Wow, look at all these little presents they've got for us. Oh, so the first one we listened to was Bart Toggle. Bart Toggle. Toggle. Okay, that was the last one. Everyone died, including him. Okay, part one, they got stranded, found the island. Part two, what's up? Son, I said wait for the storm to pass. Your life's more valuable to me than a plant patch. Oh. You stopped being in charge when the ship you were captaining sunk. I'll stop being in Only charge you when you take charge of yourself. Say, Chief. Chief. What? You know how to drain those grow beds of 40 tons of storm water? Or how to conjure food from the air? I know how to prioritize. 
I'm just saying, if that's so, what's your boy's life worth to you today? If tomorrow you're going to be so hungry, you start wondering what it tastes like. Let him go deal with it. Are we spitting facts? Son, go deal with the plot. <laughs> Bart Torgo has disembarked the habitat. Interfere wow. with my family again. And when rescue arrives, I will be you here. Do you understand me? No rescue coming, Chief. Not in time. And no staying here neither. This rain keeps falling. Sooner or later, this place will be buried. The only choice we got is whether to get buried with it. Well, if you're staying in the bottom one, yeah, sure. Maybe that's why they built the higher ones. I mean, it's a floating island. It's literally floating. You can't sink it. Oh, my God. Oh, it's PDA here. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Oh, number three, the aftermath. See, Chief, you brought us to this sodden planet. Told us we'd see a lush payday. Now what do we got some six weeks later? A dead crew, a habitat that's half buried, food washed away. I suppose the executive decisions would be better left to someone with your extensive experience of hitting people in the face. I know enough not to take unscheduled detours to uncharted planets. That's something you don't want to learn the hard way. Easy to judge a decision in hindsight. Harder to come up with a plan of your own. Got one already. We take what we can carry and hunker down in a cave somewhere. I scouted a site. A couple hundred meters deep. Lots of metal deposits. How do you imagine we'd live? With ready access to building materials? Like damn queens. A couple of water filters, a bioreactor, fresh fish. But Chief, we'll eat seaweed salad and drink our own urine if that's what it takes. All that matters is, do you got something better? Send the coordinates to my PDA. I'll review your proposal. Huh. Well, they found somewhere, so maybe we should go. Okay, number four. What is that thing? I don't know. I found it outside in the sand. Uh, part of another ship? None I've ever seen. It's not even scratched. Uh, don't fool around with it. It might be worth something. Stand down, Chief. If it were going to crumble to dust, it would have done so when I picked it up. It's glowing. We're not the first people to come to this planet. Oh, it's a purple tablet. People. Maybe. Could be aliens. Could be the damn sea monsters for all we know. One sea thing's sure, aliens. we ain't going to find out by yeah. staying here. Nice. Okay, and what have you got, Pot Togo? You've got a long thing, okay. Pineapple in the video. Chief's log, five weeks since the crash. The only other survivors are my son, Bart, and Mida, the cut price mercenary I commissioned for the journey. After days drifting in the life pod, rain hammering on the roof, the weather cleared and we washed up here. I had Mida salvage the Degazi wreck, set Bart to finding us a stable source of food. His education is paying off sooner than I'd anticipated. Our only problem is Mida. She says the weather's going to turn. I say she's finding excuses to risk our lives. But I imagine she's well, not a week in her life without a physical altercation, and she's itching for a fight. In every judgment she makes, things go from bad to worse. If she had my experience, she'd have more faith. Humans have spent millennia specializing in how to shackle nature to our will. Yeah, that's true. This planet won't cause us any new problems. My one task now is to keep us alive as comfortably as possible until the insurance company arranges rescue. In this part of space, that could be months or even years. Yeah, we're going to be here a while, aren't we? Okay, anyway guys, thank you a bunch for watching this video. It's been an absolute pleasure having you here. Again, feel free to subscribe if you like this video. There will be another one next week. And if you didn't like it, then don't subscribe. It's okay, I don't mind. I, I... You do you. You do you. So, uh, yeah, but thank you very much for making it all the way to the end. And I'll hopefully see you next week. Mwah. That was weird. <laughs> okay, it's getting dark. Okay, fish buddy, we better make a break for it. Okay, on the count of three. One, where is it? One, two, three. Ah!